everyone and welcome back to my channel so it is currently 12 11 and i have just been relaxing a little bit today today is my last day here in new jersey before i move to la tomorrow i am so so excited it still doesn't feel real like i literally say this every single day but it does not feel real i can't believe that i'm literally moving across the country like i feel like i should be like freaking out like super excited and anxious and nervous and sad like all these emotions but it, i don't know it just feels like another day to me like it's just so weird like i don't think it's really gonna hit me until i'm actually there but oh my god i have like so many last minute things to do today um, I'm gonna visit my job for the last time before I leave because I definitely need to bring some good old Jersey bagels to LA because Jersey bagels are the best bagels. They are so good and it's just like a little taste of home. So I'm gonna like freeze the bagel so then whenever I'm just craving a good bagel, I can take it out of the freezer and then I'll be good to go. I also have to go to get my nails done. My last nail appointment at my favorite nail salon. I'm definitely going to miss that place, but I mean, I'll be here in like six weeks because I'm visiting the first weekend in October. I'll just have to like try a new nail salon maybe once or twice before I come back, but I'm definitely going to time it out so then I can get my nails done here when I come visit. And then what else do I have to do today? Oh, I have to do laundry because I have some laundry to do and that stuff I'll just pack away in my carry-on. And then lastly, the big thing is packing my carry-on bag because I have not done that yet. So I'm feeling a little bit stressed out today. I have a lot to do as I just told you, but yeah, I'm just, feels weird i can't believe today is my last day here in new jersey and then i'm gonna officially be a cali girl an la girl i feel like i follow so many la youtubers like i've just always followed la vloggers and youtubers for years now and i always like look at their scenery and the backgrounds and i'm like oh my god it looks so nice but like now especially like watching their vlogs i'm like that's gonna be me i'm gonna be there walking around la and you're gonna see palm trees in my background so ah, i can't believe it it's just so wild so crazy but yeah so i am going to see if my mom is home now because i need the car it's like i told you and i think my last vlog or two vlogs ago i do not have my car because i shipped it out to la so it kind of stinks not having my car here because it's just so convenient not having to rely on others to drive you around so yeah so that's the only like sucky part but i'm so excited to have my car in la because then i can drive myself wherever whenever don't have to uber everywhere because ubers are probably so expensive in la but yeah so let's see hopefully my mom gets here soon because i have so much to do before one o'clock and it's literally 12 15 so mom hurry up please come so in my last vlog i was using my mom's car and now today i'm using my dad's i have never ever driven my dad's car like until today and I actually like it. So I am on my way to get my nails done. I've had this color for the past three weeks and I think I wanna go for a nice light pink color. Just something very nice and girly and simple. But yeah, I'm so excited to get my nails done, to get my toes done. I love getting pedicures. That is the best thing ever. I think I'm gonna do the same color on my toes. I'm just gonna do a nice light pink. Last time I got a pedicure, I got like this weird color. I don't even know what I was thinking. I was just like, oh, this is a fun summer color. It was like a orange peach color. I don't know. 
very weird, off-brand for me. But you know, I decided to try something new. And I don't know why I did that. But yeah, so I'm very excited. I can't wait to show you guys what my nails look like. I am pulling into the parking lot now, so I'll talk to you guys later. I just finished getting my nails done. This is what they look like. They look so good. I'm obsessed with this color. I'm pretty sure I've gotten this color before because I remember really, really loving it. But yeah, so I finally have my nails done. My toes are done as well. So I just got both my nails and my toes in a light pink color. But it is currently 3.14 and I still have not eaten lunch. I mean, I did have a pretty late breakfast and it was a very filling one. So I think I am going to swing by Taco Bell because there's one right across the street. How convenient. So I'm going to go there. I'm going to go to my favorite coffee shop because it'll be my very last time going there for quite some time. It'll be about like six weeks till I'm back home to visit. So I will not have the delicious coffee from this coffee shop. So I need to go there. I just can't wait to eat some Taco Bell. I'm so excited. And also, um, no one is home right now and I do not have my house keys. So I need to kill some time while I'm still out. So, yeah, so that is the game plan. I think I'm also gonna visit the little girls I used to babysit too, so then I can say goodbye to them before I leave. So, it's gonna be so sad. I'm gonna miss them so, so much, but I know I'll be home very soon to visit. I got my favorite coffee from one of my favorite coffee shops. This is the Iced Caramel Mac Latte but I get it with oat milk instead of macadamia milk. But now I am going to swing by and visit the girls that I have babysitted the past few months. I'm so sad to say goodbye to them, but I know that I will definitely see them soon. Whenever I come home to visit, I will for sure visit them as well, so. I'm very excited to see them. So I am back home as you can see and I have so much stuff to do you guys. This is insane. So number one on my to-do list is my laundry because that stuff has to go in my carry-on bag and then I have like a whole list of things I need to put in my carry-on which I gotta do but that you will have already seen in my pack with me video which is where i announced that i'm actually moving to la so um that's already up on my channel so go check it out if you haven't already but there i'll show you guys everything that i packed in my carry-on bag i think for this video i'm just going to show you guys what i'm packing in my personal item because I'm not going to include that in that pack with me video. So you guys will get a glimpse of me kind of sort of packing. Like doing just like last minute packing stuff in this video. Guys, this is the last sushi I'll have from our favorite sushi slash hibachi place for a while. At least until October. But oh my god, I'm going to be so sad. I won't be able to go here. But I'm sure that there's going to be amazing sushi places in LA. But, you know, I'm going to miss my hometown sushi place. So, this is the roll I got. The one over here. This is the one my dad got. This one is called the Sumo Roll. It's been my favorite one to get because it's so, so good. It has this like, yummy sauce on top. But yeah, so I'm going to enjoy every single bite. So I just finished eating my sushi. It was so, so good. But now it is time to pack my personal item. So my personal item I'm using is actually my college backpack. So it's just this black Vera Bradley bag. It's so cute and it's so durable and I've had it for years and it's just amazing. So 
bags and that is what I'm going to be packing right now. Um, luckily, there is so much room in here so I can definitely fit a lot. Oh my god, I still have some stuff from school in here. I have folders, this little planner, an umbrella, um, and some other random things that I definitely need to take out. Oh, I have Tylenol, perfect. That comes in handy. And then I have a Shout Wipe and Go. So I'll keep that in here, cause you know me, you know I'm very clumsy. But everything else I don't really need at all, so I'm just going to take it out of my bag. Okay, so first things first, I'm going to pack my purse because since I'm gonna be on the plane, I don't really need my purse handy. I'm just gonna put my wallet um, in like probably the front pocket or just on top of my actual backpack. So I'm just gonna lay that flat on the bottom. I also have my blanket because I might be cold on the plane. I don't know. I mean, I'm gonna be wearing long sleeves. I always wear leggings and a sweatshirt on the plane. So I don't think I'm really gonna need this, but just in case I wanna get extra comfy while I am editing a video or just like watching Netflix, I'm gonna see if I can download the episodes of Outer Banks. Cause I still have not watched season two. I need to watch it before my roommates like probably spoil it for me. I don't know if they've seen it yet, but gotta do it before they tell me all about it. And earlier today, I stopped for bagels. So of course this Jersey girl has to bring some Jersey bagels to Callie's. I just brought some for my roommates and I. Actually, I think I'm gonna put this on the very top of my backpack because I am probably going to see if I could switch it into my carry-on. Actually, I don't think that's gonna happen. My carry-on is like packed to the max right now, so never mind. I think I'm just gonna smush this in here. It's crazy how much stuff I have in here. And then I have some stuff from Walgreens. I got popcorners, I got milk chocolate covered pretzels, and then I got myself some gum because you definitely need gum on the plane. And then I also need to pack this. This is my external hard drive for my videos. So I'm gonna pack that in here as well. And then tomorrow morning, I just have to remember to pack my chargers. I cannot forget about my chargers. Okay, I think that is it with my personal item. I think all I have to do is add my electronics in here, which I'll do in the morning. I'm just making sure that everything is fully charged. For the most part, this is packed up and ready to go. Oh, I need my book even though I like hardly ever read. I forgot to tell you guys this before, but my grandpa swung by to say goodbye to me and I was very hard. And she was like so sad to like say goodbye to my grandpa. It's crazy how like fast time flew. I was thinking about this, like this was just an idea, like not even a year ago of me like moving to LA. And now that it's like the day before, I'm like, oh my God, it's literally here. Like tomorrow I leave for LA. But I'm excited for you all to be on this journey with me. I'm so excited for all the moving vlogs. I can't wait to just decorate my room. I have like a perfect aesthetic I'm going for. I'm just so excited. I can't wait for you guys to see everything and I can't wait to make my dreams a reality. Oh my god you guys I'm literally going to cry. My best friends Nicoletta and Shivani. I'm sure you guys have seen them before in the vlogs. 
they just swung by my house and surprised me with a strawberry milkshake and i got to see them one last time before i leave tomorrow and it just meant so much to me i'm like they're literally my best friends in the world so it meant so much so if you're watching shiv and nicoletta i love you guys so much i'll see you in three weeks because they're coming to visit me which i'm so excited about so ah <sighs> that was so nice i'm so happy i got to see them but yeah so back to packing my clothes are all dry and i literally have so much stuff i really do not know how i am possibly going to fit this in my carry-on bag but pray for me guys just pray for me i don't know how i'm gonna do this